The explosive eruptions of the Stromboli volcano were so powerful that they caught most of the monitoring networks by surprise. This phenomenon not only poses a scientific challenge, but also a serious danger, especially for volcanoes located in inhabited or heavily visited areas. One of the most famous explosive volcanoes in the world is Stromboli, located in the Aeolian Islands off the coast of Sicily. Its gentle but spectacular eruptions, which eject lava and incandescent fragments to a height of several hundred meters, have occurred at an almost constant rate every 10 to 20 minutes for thousands of years. The Stromboli volcano in Italy experienced a sudden increase in volcanic activity. This increase occurred when an eruption fissure opened at the bottom of the volcano northeastern crater, and few hours later, a new pyroclastic flow followed spreading to the sea surface along the Schiara del Fuoco. This continuous moderate eruptive activity is unique. This is why Stromboli has become an international reference point in the study of eruption dynamics. Many of the technological and methodological innovations commonly used in today volcano observatories were developed and calibrated on Stromboli. Two major eruptions that occurred in July and August 2019. They produced eruption columns several kilometers high, as well as fires and tsunami waves, which ended up covering coastal villages with ash and rocks. This led to an immediate upgrade in the volcano monitoring system and an improvement in communication between the scientific community and the operational structures of the National Service. These powerful explosions involved the interior of the magmatic system and are therefore believed to have followed a dynamic process different from ordinary activity. The use of highly sensitive sensors capable of measuring angles of several million degrees has shown that these powerful explosions were preceded by weak but perceptible ground deformations. The entire volcano began to inflate about 10 minutes before the eruption, following an exponential trend due to the expansion of gases during the rise of magma in the inlet. Then, during the eruption, the deformation reversed as the volcano deflated due to the release of gases and lava fragments into the atmosphere. The Laboratory of Experimental Geophysics at the University of Florence, in collaboration with many researchers from Italian universities, has analyzed thousands of data points collected over 15 years of research. This has made it possible to determine that the volcano deforms in the same way following an inflationary cycle with each eruption from the weakest to the strongest. The stronger the eruption, the greater the amplitude and duration of the inflation, but the temporal pattern remains unchanged. This shows that the explosive process always follows the same dynamics and makes it possible to distinguish the deformation of the ground before the eruption from signals generated by other natural sources.